Hello, hello, hello. We are just getting set up. Hey, hey, hey. Hi, everybody. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> There's our little Yorkie in the background. <laughs> mm, thank you, Holy Spirit. We are just getting set up. Just giving a few minutes for everybody to log in. Hey, Mom. How are you? I'm going to be praying for dental miracles today. A lot of people have contacted the ministry wanting prayer for their teeth. So, we just uh, can't wait to see what Holy Ghost is going to do. We just release your presence, Lord. <laughs> just share the broadcast. I'm going to be praying for dental miracles today. A lot of people have contacted the ministry wanting prayer for their teeth. So, we just uh, can't wait to see what Holy Ghost is going to do. Thank you, Lord. Hey, Sherry, can you hear us? We're just testing the broadcast. All right. Can everybody hear us good? Just want to know the sound is working. Hey, Susan, how are you? Blessings to you. We're so excited to see and share this testimony of Jesus Christ and his healing power and his faithfulness. He cares about the small things. That's what I love and about this testimony. Hey, Megan, Louisiana. Everybody just tell us where you're from. Just going to give you an update and pray for dinner, dental miracles. Dinner too, honey. Dinner too, right? <laughs> pray I cook it well, right? Those no, are. this season. <laughs> Uh, hey, Meg. Hey, all good. The sound is good. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. <laughs> right. We haven't done this in a while, so I'm trying to adjust everything we've got on over here. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> probably probably took it well. Isn't that right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Let's keep sharing the broadcast. Everybody tell us where you're from. I'm going to share it real quick, and we're going to um, pray for dinner, dental miracles. Are you in dinner mode? Today? I know. It just keeps coming out as dinner. Dinner, dinner, dinner. I don't even have to cook tonight, people. We're going over, and somebody else is cooking for us. <laughs> I'm from India. India, yay. Boy, we're just giving a few minutes. There's people from all over the world that has contacted us. We want to make sure they get on um, to receive their miracle for their mouth. I'm so excited. Excited at what Jesus Christ has done. Let him be high and lifted up. And uh, share the testimony. I'm going to let my husband share it when he's ready. <laughs> Have you shared yet? From India. All right. Are you lying? I am, I am. Okay. For what a reason, I'm not seeing it on your profile yet. Hey, hey, hey. All right. So, is anybody else from outside the country? We had people contacting me. Are you hungry? Mom said you're probably right. Exactly. <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking about Jesus and the multiplication of bread, right? <laughs> uh, thank you, Lord. We just release your presence over everybody watching right now. We just thank you for your glory. We just invite you, Holy Spirit. Yes, Lord. We just honor you, Lord. I can't wait for my husband to share this unique testimony and to see what God's going to do in each one of your lives. Thank you, Lord. How many on here are needing a, a dental miracle? Just type it in the broadcast. Oh, Meg said it wasn't on the broadcast. I'll double check it. Thank you, Megan, for letting us know. Thank you, Lord. We just release your presence. Lord, I just bind all distraction from everybody here. Lord, I just release your glory right now. I just feel the glory really, really thick in here. I just want to release it over you right now. <laughs> yes, Lord. We thank you for righteousness, peace, and joy flowing into your atmosphere, the kingdom of heaven flowing into your atmosphere. Yeah. Thank you, Megan, for letting us know. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> Thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm still trying to figure out this set. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> we praise you, God. Let this presence just wash over you right now. 
And if you're getting prayer, try not to pray in the spirit, which kind of pushes out because then you're ministering. Just receive. If you can sit somewhere and relax or you're in the car, if you can park and just receive when Richard and I pray for your teeth. Um, Mom said me. <laughs> Thank you, Lord. That's your presence. Thank you, God. Thank you for your presence. I want this. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your presence. All right, babe. All Are right. Are you ready to share the testimony? <laughs> well, I'm going to go ahead and introduce ourselves from folks who may not know us or our ministry. Mm-hmm. Um, my name is Richard Stutzman, and my lovely wife, April, is uh, from Kingdom Flame Ministries. And so if you like us, check us out. You can go over to uh, kingdomflameministries.com. Uh, we have multiple teachings and such, and my wife has written two books, which she's going to uh, demonstrate right now and share a little bit about it. Yeah, um, yeah. I wrote the Chronicles of a Discerner. You can see it right here, because when I was walking in discerning of spirits, and we have the audio book too, um, there was a few people that I knew that walked heavy in this gift, um, and I had to spend money and time flying out and training and spending time with Holy Spirit trying to understand this gift, and I just needed something real practical in the process to help me gain muscle on carrying discerning of spirits, which there's not a whole lot of teaching out there, and so I kind of wrote it so that people could have almost like a diary process of being able to steward the discerning of spirits and how the Holy Spirit can walk you through the process and give you muscle and help you to understand more revelation about that gift. And I also wrote Gateway to My Miracle where I was bedridden and God healed me instantly of fibromyalgia. So if you need a miracle in in the area of fibromyalgia, I definitely recommend this book. We have the audio version of that too. But um, basically... (laughs) <laughs> Holy Spirit, when he's when he's doing something new on the earth, especially with discerning of spirits, there's always people that have paid the price and forerun for this generation to carry this gift. And so I'm so thankful for the people that have forerun it. But I know that this is something the Holy Spirit is highlighting to me in this season that's so needed in the area of deliverance and it's so needed in the churches. And I know that this is an area that God is imparting. And I, I release impartation in the book. I release impartation in the audio book. And uh, thank you for writing it because I need, I want to learn to discern. Amen, Meg. I, I just bless you with that right now, Lord. I just thank you, Lord, that you give her more. But um, the process of growing and discerning the spirits is very unique, and you kind of feel like you're in your own tribe sometimes. So I just wanted to connect. I wrote this book like you're talking to me one on one, and we're connecting, and I'm helping you to understand why we're wired differently, and it, it's for kingdom purposes. It's a, it's a gift of the Holy Spirit. And we, I just honor that gift, and that's why I wrote that book. Hey, Justina, how are you? And um, I just, I just can't wait to see. We've been getting testimonies. People have gotten delivered, reading, discerning of the spirits. People are growing. So keep sharing your testimonies. They mean so much to me because I, I just want to see the body of Christ to, to move in in this gift and stewarding it well and growing in it and finding safe places to to harness it and use their gift. Um, where the Holy Spirit leads and calls you to to use that gift in this hour. So, Amen. I'm going to share some uh, scripture verse with you. And then also, uh, mm-hmm. well, thank you. I appreciate you following us. That's uh, meaningful to both of us. And one of these days, I'm going to encourage April to actually have a class on her book. Probably both of them will be excellent. Uh, But I want to share some scripture verse with you, and then I'm going to share uh, the testimony um, at the conference that April and I was at and uh, just had a word of knowledge about acute pain. And every time there is a creative miracle, love you too, uh, every time there's a miracle that uh, God has allowed us to Mm -hmm. see and and demonstrate, we become the hands and feet of Jesus. It just excites both of us Mm -hmm. because we want to grow in the creativity what god is doing in the atmosphere what god's doing in the service and so psalm 6 2 says please deal gently with me yahweh and show me mercy for i am sick and frail and weak heal me yahweh for i'm falling apart and there's another translation that says heal me yahweh for my bones are shaking Mm -hmm. and so we're just going to declare the uh, the word of the lord 
that our bones do not shake and you can have physical bones in the mouth structure uh, the gum line and things of that nature is still bone connection uh, in Isaiah 58 verse, verse 11 it says the Lord will continue to guide you and satisfy your desires and give you strength to your bones and again um, you know, a friend of ours, um, acquainted, I guess, mm-hmm. Jennifer Eves, she always emphasizes having a scripture verse with what you're going to uh, preach on, what you're going to demonstrate and see in your life. And so I said, okay, I need to have some scripture verses about bones. Thank you, Megan. Um, the other one is Psalm 60. Oh, you already got it. Woo, she's, she's on the fast. ball. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, Holy you. Ghost, for all these scribes out here. <laughs> I, I'm reading off my page over here, Megan Song. <laughs> I'm only doing one one way. Uh, so uh, in the Psalm 3, 7 in the Passion Trans says, Rise up and help me, Yahweh. Come and save me. For you have slapped them in the face, breaking off the powers of the words and, that will harm me. Basically, word curses. Yeah. And you may say, well, what is that hey, has God. to do with the, uh, the, the, the bones? Well, you know what? If you're having trouble sometimes, and I'm not going to say this is all the ways, it could be demonic uh, witchcraft prayers mm-hmm. that is causing... Um, structure to your bones and you got to realize this is that the enemy doesn't want you to speak he doesn't want you to declare he doesn't want you to prophesy he just wants to cause mm-hmm. pain and and because our words and our voice articulate power god wants us to know that that's where the enemy can hit us at times and so not all the time but i just want to share that with you mm-hmm. the other scripture verse i'm going to share with you is amos 4 6 is it but i will also clean the teeth into your city and so God wants to do creative mm-hmm. miracles yeah. in your teeth, in your gum lines, uh, whatever you, whatever you're need of. I believe Jesus has paid the debt on the cross for us that we can have live in perfect peace and harmony. Mm-hmm. So um, I got this uh, email about uh, about a, I guess about a couple of days later. We went to Charlie Champ and we served up there and ministered and volunteered up there and. Uh, Amen. Uh, and in the part of it, uh, there was an opportunity for uh, a couple of us to give words of knowledge. And I just had a word of knowledge of acute uh, teeth uh, in somebody's mouth. And a, a few people came up for that. And we just prayed in the name of Jesus. And um, So for the people that don't know what a word of knowledge is, most of you guys know. But for the people that don't know, explain go ahead. what a word go of ahead. knowledge is. Go ahead. You explain, is. dear. <laughs> What's your definition of word knowledge? <laughs> well, it's usually revelation and impression that the Holy Spirit gives you about a condition in somebody's life. It could be a word of knowledge on healing. It could be a word of knowledge on deliverance. But it's basically information that the Holy Spirit gives to say, okay, I see a hip. It could be sight, sense, spiritual senses that you have that needs to be healed. It's whatever information the Holy Spirit gives you. And the word of knowledge, uh, the basic five staple food for those who may not know, is you can see it, you can hear it, you can uh, say it as God is giving you a word about somebody. Uh, you can uh, feel it, uh, pain, uh, you know, and uh, and you can see it over people's heads. And there's other things that God has uh, blessed me with uh, additional to that where you can have like a picture in picture or you can have an open vision. Uh, you can have a dream about it. And so these are just things that uh, we all want to excel in that God gives us. And so um, and so I just wrote down the like four things before we got up there. And uh, But anyhow, uh, I want to share this testimony f- for you because it really has blessed me. Mm-hmm. And I've been challenged uh, from Holy Spirit to, to do this. Yes. To be honest with you, this is not my comfort zone <laughs> to actually do some of the things that we do. But I do believe that th- there are people... Uh, in different places, maybe in India, who's on here, maybe yes. in Brazil or yeah. different places that may, uh, they don't have access to go see a dentist. And so mm-hmm. uh, I also know there are people that have has reached out to me regarding my posts. And I'm like, honey, we need to just go ahead and do this so we can be encouragement to the body of Christ. And so she said, Richard, you prayed for my teeth and I got to create a miracle. Yes, you had a word of knowledge for mm-hmm. tooth pain. And that was during the second session. And so sometimes I will uh, have words of knowledge, and I don't necessarily know when I said it, so I like the accuracy. You pray for an angel to perform a creative miracle in my mouth, and it did. I had a lot of dental work throughout the years, a lot of feelings. Anytime I would be 
feeling I get a feeling and it would be very difficult to get it to the exact shape and as the original tooth and a lot of times they ended up not being the same to my bite and that's changed over the years and force has been uh it has the force in the mouth has not been distributed yeah. uh, evenly and so I can't really identify with that um statement in that email because I've been having pretty pretty decent teeth so I, I'm so thankful for that she said it, it cost me a lot of pain in my teeth yeah. also pain in my jaw uh, it's a misalignment jaw in bones. the teeth and the jaw but I definitely can tell later that evening especially the next morning when I woke up that everything came back in harmony and alignment mm -hmm. so when the bite it would fit from the top to bottom and about two weeks later uh, she went to the uh, dentist's office yeah. And uh, this is what she's quoted the doctor. My dentist just confirmed that healing that I got from the Fire Oil Glory Conference. She was amazed because my bite and jaw alignment has dramatically, drastically changed and is perfect. Now, she goes from not perfect to perfect. So, I mean, you, Jesus. <laughs> to me at that point in time, I mean, it just kind of rocks my world, you know. Uh -huh. Blake, I mean, it's just incredible. And so she agreed that I received a miracle, and she was just so excited as I am. She put, she believes in the supernatural and quantum physics, but hasn't gotten to the Jesus part yet. Mm -hmm. So I'm thankful that she's able to use this create a miracle to, to share it as a testimony, but not only to her dentist, yeah. who she's trying to uh, present the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ, but also for those that are around them. And so... God wants to know that everything that it's healings and miracles, it all points to Him. It's not about an individual, but it points to the goodness and mercy of who God is. And uh, a couple of days later, when I was out and about um, in my workplace, and uh, I got up the next morning, and the Lord spoke to me and said, "Richard, what's the Greek word or what's the Hebrew word for do it again?" And I'm like, "Well, I'm kind of busy right now, and I don't know what that word is, and maybe we have a." historical or a theological person on here that may be able to type that out or maybe comment it later on when they, when they uh, do the replay on here. Uh, what is the Greek word for do, do it again? again. Gotcha. And, uh, and I, I'm aware that, uh, you know, there is a, a singer uh, in Charlotte who has come up with a song called Do It Again, Lord. So he goes, and I said, I heard the Lord say, yeah. and I looked up, do it again. He goes, I am the do it again God. It is who I am. It is my DNA. It is forever the same. Lord, I say, do it again. Mm -hmm. And so we're at this part in this broadcast where we're actually going to pray that the angel of the Lord will come and do it again in your situation, in your life. Yeah, um, and uh, if we have a few other words of knowledge for physical healing, we may end up uh, doing those. But I, I really want to focus on that because it is a, a step of faith. It is, uh, you know, I, I come before the Lord with fear and trembling, you know, because it's not yeah. something that we just come up here and do just because we have a gift. And, and, and we celebrate what God wants to do. But you have to hear our hearts. And a heart is always about turning people relationship-wise, reconciliation, who God the Father is. And so we're just going to praise. And if you want to, as a point of contact, just take your hands and um, pay, place it upon your, your cheekbone, place it Thank upon you, your, your bones, you. place it upon underneath uh, uh, in your area. Uh, I'm actually seeing somebody who's having some deterioration underneath the jawbone, down here underneath here. Mm. And so God is going to touch it whether you're on here right now or whether or not you're going to be watching this on the replay. Um, I believe the God of miracles, the Captain mm. Kuhlman, you said, I believe in God. Mm. And, uh, and, and it, it just amazes me. And so, Father God, right now, in the name of Jesus, we just come before you. We come before you right now, Holy Spirit. Lord, we welcome Holy Spirit in this session. And Father, we just welcome Holy Spirit that the anointing will go forth right now in the name of Jesus. That those that are needing a dental miracle, Father, right now, uh, even with the replay, Lord, we just say, Father God, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, just Psalms 103, send your angels of heirs of salvation, Father, right now in the name of Jesus. Father, I thank you, Holy Spirit, that you are the God who saves, you're the God who heals, 
You're the God who delivers. And Father, I thank you, Holy Spirit, Lord, that right now in the name of Jesus Christ, I just ask you, Holy Spirit, that you release the angels. You release the created miracle angels here on assignment, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. And Father, you said by your stripes, Lord, that you are healed. And I thank you, Holy Spirit, right now that by your words, you spoke the words. And, Lord, we're declaring and decreeing as the words go forth out of our mouths, Father, that, Lord, you're honoring the healing mantle, Father, right now to flow in the name of Jesus. And, Lord, I just say any degenerative disease, Father, it's actually on my left side. It could be your right. Sometimes when I see things, it's just the opposite or feel things. And so, Lord, we just command any degenerative disease, mouth disease, Father, right now, and agendonitis right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I command that here to be healed right now by the power and the authority of Jesus Christ. Go ahead, and, Lord, I just speak to gum disease, and I declare by your stripes you are healed right now. We speak to that inflammation. We curse it at its root right now. I just thank you, Holy Spirit. We just speak to mouse. We say align, align, align in the name of Jesus. And, and his word says by his stripes that you are healed. There's no classification. If any area of your body is sick right now, put your hands on it and the Lord's even showing me right now there's actually like a jaw alignment. He wants to heal TMJ right now that it's causing issues with your teeth and with your mouth. So we just command TMJ to be healed right now by the power of the Holy Beautiful. Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ. And I just see the Lord realigning hips right now. I, I know I'm shifting gears, but I see it in the spirit realm. I just command hips to be healed right now and be aligned right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I just break off that spirit of affliction, that spirit of infirmity right now in the name of Jesus. The Lord, we just command right now anywhere where any tooth, yeah. uh, and I know I have one request in the natural uh, that is asking God to uh, to replace that broken tooth with a new one. And so I'm just that type of person, a man of God, that I will tell you whether I know the natural or whether someone else has it. Yeah. So, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, we just ask you, Holy Spirit, right now, that you just replace that broken tooth, chip tooth, yeah. right now. And, Lord, if there's even any person who has a feeling, Lord Jesus, yeah. that is, it is chipped, yeah. Father, we just release the power and the presence of God right now in the name of Jesus Christ with the power and the presence right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We say new teeth right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I just declare and decree, Father, right now, if you want to crown them with your glory, Father, right now in the name of Jesus Christ, we just say crown them with your glory. Manifest your glory, Father, right now in the name of Jesus, Lord. Just send your angels of creative miracles, Father, right now. Lord, if you want to put a crown in somebody's mouth, Lord, we just declare and decree, Father, as to a gathering of your name, Lord, there is power in the midst of them. And so, Lord, we just release that power. Lord, we release that presence, Father, right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, dear. I just see the Lord healing migraines right now. If you've got a headache, just put your hand on your head. Lord, we rebuke that right now in the name of Jesus. We command creative order right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody had a question on here. I'm trying to pay attention to your conference. Uh, so, Lord, right now, in the name of... We'll hit it at the end, baby. Okay. It's about a word of knowledge and wisdom. Okay. So, Father God, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, um, either that or we can email them separate. So, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus, I say that abscess tooth right okay. now that's uh, throbbing. Yeah. Um, you hit the DK. Let me hit the throbbing here. Okay. So, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus, I command that abscess tooth to be healed by the power and the glory of Jesus Christ. I command the abscess tooth that goes into the deep, deep, deep right now in the name of Jesus. It's deep in the um, the jawbone. It's deep in, in the gum line right now. I command that to come up and out right now. And I command uh, that inflammation to go, spirit of infirmity and affliction. We just command it up and out right now by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. And I just speak to that decay. And I say right now, be made whole. By the name of Jesus Christ, right now, show. I just thank you, Lord, that you're putting new teeth into people's mouth that need new teeth right now. Every area of decay right now, we just say, by his stripes, you are healed in Jesus' name. 
Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Huh. Thank you, Lord. Now, I I actually saw someone, um, and again, I don't know if you're on here now, if you're going to replay this, but I actually saw somebody, it actually was a lady, uh, on her upper teeth, they're all, uh, well, you, I always use the word fake, but they're implants. Yeah. Uh, and... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You know, when we when we talk about things as such, uh, you know, it, it makes the religious people just so upset because, you know, they want to say, where's that in the Bible? You know, there's a phrase and a scripture verse, and, and there are more recorded miracles that was not recorded in the Bible. And so I just tagged that on to the, you know what, this is one of those created crazy thing, crazy miracles that people generally don't go after. But, you know, I, I've been running around with some... Uh, Young folks who, and older folks that just believe in the supernatural, and I just go for it. Yeah, wow. And so, Father, right now, in the name of Jesus, whoever this young lady is, and it could be a man, but I just saw the impression of a woman. Lord, where the dentures are at, Lord Jesus. Okay. Lord, that you would just supernaturally bring forth back, right now, new teeth, right now, in the name of Jesus. I declare and decree, Lord, you say we have not because we ask not. And, Lord, you saw, all word also says we ask in doubt we will never receive. And, Lord, we, re, we just declare and decree it's by faith right now in the name of Jesus. And we just command those dentures right now come and be manifest. Brand new teeth. Brand new teeth. Power in the fire right now in Jesus' mighty name. Amen, amen. And we just declare over Susan right now. We just say thank you, Lord. For your angels on assignment thank you for creative miracles we thank you lord by your stripes she is healed we thank you for new teeth right now in the name of jesus we just speak alignment to jaws right now and for the same miracle that god has no respect or person where the tooth was aching and the line the jaw was aligned we just release that over everybody under the sound of our voice replays right now in the name of jesus and we just ask you to send in your testimonies just message us um the holy spirit specifically told us to go after these dental miracles that he was going to perform so we know that and we expect the holy spirit to show up so we thank you jesus for what you're doing in people's mouth right now some people even feel fire in their mouth you may feel tingling in your mouth I just thank you, Lord. I see actually a recreation of teeth right now. So I just kind of bless what the Lord's doing right now. And I thank you, Lord, even for people in other nations, Lord. We just say, be made whole to the teeth right now in the name of Jesus. And uh, I think somebody's going to be on the, uh, the replay. I know Meg, Meg's on here, but I, I heard almost Megiana. Megiana. So, Lord, I just declare and decree whatever Megiana is declaring and decreeing for and receiving healing in her body, Lord, we just release uh, your angels on assignment, Father, right now in the name of Jesus to touch her from the top of her head uh, to the soles of her feet. Mm -hmm. Lord, we say come alive in her body, come alive in her body. We declare and decree the life of God that will enter in into her body right now. In the name of Jesus. Maybe you're on here right now, and maybe you know somebody by that name. Uh, I just hear and just seeing that, you know, they, they need to have the, the breath of God, mm -hmm. the life of God into them. And so, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, we just declare and decree, Father, a divine restoration, Megiana, in, in Jesus' mighty name. Lord, we just declare and decree, Father, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ. I actually see the Lord setting somebody free. I know this is a different word of knowledge, but I see him destroying the stronghold of shame, fear, and control. So we just speak to that stronghold and declare and decree that who, Jesus, who the Son sets free is free indeed, and that's you. We thank you, Lord, right now. Even right now, strongholds are falling down in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. So I'm going to just kind of shift just a little bit. Uh, my wife has liberty to pop any words of knowledge. <laughs> I'm trying to stay focused. And yes, uh, is Blake still on here or did he pop off of here? Anyhow, if you are on here, just say hey again. Um, I I just, it has to do with your teeth, but it also has to do with, I call the mind-binding spirit uh, mm -hmm. that attacks it sometimes. So, it, you know, it's in your jawbone, in your brain. Uh, and so, Lord, we just break and in, in any assignment of the enemy that is sending mind-binding spirits uh, almost projectually uh, in their minds. And so, Lord, we cancel that. 
we uh, break the assignment of the enemy right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We command that up and out right now by the blood of Jesus Christ, by the blood of Jesus Christ. And Lord, we just declare and decree, Father, right now in the name of Jesus Christ, a sound mind. Yes. I declare and decree and I release it, Lord, as a man of God, a sound mind right now in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, thank you, Sandra, for sharing that testimony. You enjoyed the book of Discerner, and thank you for the teaching. Oh, that was Holy Spirit's idea, totally. It was his inspiration to write the book. And I just want to impart to everybody under the sound of my voice while you're on here, I just release more of discerning of spirits right now. What I freely give, what I freely receive, I freely give right now in the name of Jesus. Just increase them by the power of the Holy Spirit. And if you feel led, um, go ahead and write a review on Amazon. It really blesses my heart and, and share the testimony or email the testimony to us about um, different areas. I'm just so excited to see people finally understanding their gift of discerning of spirits and how to walk in it and what it means and what it looks like. Amen. Looks like you have another word of knowledge. I do? Where? <laughs> what does that say, honey? Five miles? Is that what that How about says? smiles? Oh, smiles. Gotcha, gotcha. My, my, <laughs> wife, my wife gets so intense, guys, I'm telling you. It's like... <laughs> so sometimes I have to lighten it up. So, honey... <laughs> <laughs> I need to smile a little bit. I don't care if you're kicking oh, yeah, out the we devil. Bless Heather. We say more, 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 more. Amen. <laughs> oh man, um, this is this is kind of uh, kind of crazy. Um, what you're seeing? Yeah, it's almost like on the top, on the inside of your teeth. Like, uh, and you know, I've I, I've been under different ministries and such, and where they have created miracles and even. Uh, this will stretch people. Uh, God will actually put a, 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 a feeling like a cross. Mm. And really wow. that uh, stretches me to no end, <laughs> but I know it's God. So I'm not going to question that. I'm on here doing other things on here. So it's a good I can say. So anyhow, I just say, yes, it is. I just say, Lord, the inside of somebody's mouth, there are some feelings. And I'm actually seeing it white. And you can either get them gold or you can actually get them white. And uh, so, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, I just command those feelings to be strong. I command right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, that you would just uh, reinforce what is there, Lord Jesus. And, Lord, if you deem that Mm. the the feeling uh, from the natural uh, um, color, Mm. you remember what the name of it's called in a dentist's office? I don't remember. You don't remember? Mm. Somebody probably here on here probably knows it. Um, <laughs> it's escaping my mind. Uh, but Lord, we just say the natural uh, laminate that's in there, Lord Jesus, and that's not the word I, I do apologize right now. You mean to change the color? The enamel, the yes. The enamel. The white. Yeah, yeah. Is it called enamel? Enamel, yeah. Okay. So Lord, Lord, if, if Lord, if you deem Lord Jesus the word, they need it stronger yeah. uh, because of things that they eat. Lord, Happens. we just declare and decree. Uh, that it will turn into gold right now in the name of Jesus Christ. That, Lord, when they go back into the doctor's office, the doctor's going to look into their mouth and say, oh, boy, uh, (laughs) who's been working in your teeth? Because this used to be natural white, kind of like my uh, my front tooth up here. Uh, I guess I'm saying this on national Facebook here. (laughs) It's just natural white. Badly stained. Badly stained? Yeah. So, So... Okay. For, yeah, so Lord, we just lightning. we just say right now in the name of Jesus, just you just reinforce what's there, Lord. I thank Amen. you, Holy Spirit, Lord. You're allowing me to see it, to declare it, and decree it. Yeah, and so Lord, we just say manifest right now in their in their teeth area. And Lord, if there's anything else that is um, Actually, I, I don't know the name, and this is the challenge in the seer realm or words pictures, knowledge, yeah. is that when you have words of knowledge and you don't know the word of it, uh, almost those af- as if, and I'm not going to say this is in Africa, but I'm just, uh, uh, it could be here in the United States, you know. Uh, it's like the gum lines. Uh, yes, he gets the glory all the way, absolutely. Uh, it's like the gum lines is be, uh, deteriorated altogether where it's just... Uh, it just has rotted. Uh, I guess that's the best way I can explain it, how I am seeing it. 
So I just say, God, recreate that mouth yeah. structure yeah. right now in the name of Jesus. We say recreate the gum lines, the tissues, the ligaments, the bone structure, Father, right now. Power, fire right now in the name of Jesus. I command the gum lines to be manifest brand new right now in the name of Jesus Christ. The gum lines right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Gum lines right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I declare and decree, Lord, the gum lines be made whole right now. The jaw bones, the bones that are not there that has deteriorated. Lord, we just command it, Father, right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We declare and decree, Father, right now, perfect teeth. Perfect alignment right now in the name of Jesus. The top teeth, the bottom teeth, right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, gum disease, we just commanded to go right now in the name of Jesus. Go ahead and do Heather's prayer. And right now, Lord, any receding gums, we just speak to you. We command you to be made whole right now in the name of Jesus. And there's no limit to what God can do. God's brain is way bigger than mine. And so I'm just going to pray. Um, we have a request for stained teeth. So, Lord, in your glory, in your presence, Lord, I ask you to restore restitution to everything the enemy stole right now, even to teeth color. Holy Spirit, if that's something the Holy Spirit wants to do, Lord, we just bless right now what you want to do. Right now, we ask you for restitution to reverse what the enemy's done, any attack on the teeth that changed the coloring. And we just break this color, this coloration off. In the name of Jesus, and I just thank you for an increase from day to day to wider and wider teeth in the name of Jesus Christ. So, Lord, word that receding gum line is in Lord Jesus almost, it's, it's my left, I'm feeling it, so it could be your right. So I just command, and it's on the outside, and so, more so anyhow. And so, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, I just command that receding gum line to come up right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Um, there's that soft tissue. Again, I'm not a doctor, but I do know Dr. Jesus. And I know Dr. Jesus gives <laughs> Dr. me pictures Jesus. and everything. And sometimes I struggle and say, God, can't you just give me everything? Uh, so, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus, that left side, Lord, uh, of the gum line, Lord, I command that soft tissue to be be recreated right now in the name of Jesus. I declare and decree, Father, right now in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus Christ. Gum lines. Come back right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Snug those teeth right now in the name of Jesus yeah, Christ. I actually had a word of knowledge, Lisa, and I wasn't sure um, what the Lord was doing there, but it was for nerve pain. So, um, Lord, I just command the nerves to be made whole right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Any damage in, in the G jaw, teeth, head from the nerve condition, we just command right now by the power of the Holy Spirit, we speak to those nerves. We declare and decree creative order with heaven right now in the name of Jesus. Creative order, creative order by a power of your Holy Spirit right now. Recreate, recreate. I just see nerves being recreated right now by the authority of Jesus Christ. Amen. She quoted it. I just tag on to April right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, we just command any nerve endings, um, even the center of, uh, of a tooth, uh, right now, in the name of Jesus, I can never, every nerves, uh, even uh, in the wisdom teeth, I think you have four uh, roots, uh, posts, so to speak of, I guess. Uh, it'd be nice for me to have a picture there. <laughs> I just, uh, you have to understand, I'm not a doctor. I, I'm just telling you what I'm seeing. And, and that's just, you know, it's a great, it's a great gift to have, to be honest with you. But it, it, in the, the four post, three, four, right of nerve system, where it goes down deep into the tooth gum issues, Father, we just declare and free every, every single nerves that goes in there to be, uh, uh, I command any nerve ending damage to come yeah, up and out right sure now the in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now in the name of Jesus. Right now, right now, Holy Spirit. All of it right now in the name of Jesus. And also I see that part of that has to do with somebody's headaches. Mm -hmm. uh, a constant throbbing headache that you're having. It's kind of a, a deep uh, yeah. thing that is going on here. And so it's it's wonderful that my wife has these things <laughs> because uh, I, I really am seeing it in the spiritual realm. And trying to uh, sometime articulate that <laughs> is my challenge, but it's a good challenge to have. At least I'm seeing things, you know. So I just try to be a blessing at what Holy Spirit is doing and just breathe upon it. So, Lord, right now, yeah, we just command all of it to, to come up and out right now in the name of Jesus. 
up and out right now in the name of Jesus. Mm-hmm. Up and out right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We command every post that goes deep into the sockets, to the jawbone, I command mm-hmm. everything up and out right now in the name of Jesus. Up and out right now. And I command any nerve-ending headaches mm-hmm. to come up and get out right now in the name of Jesus. I almost see somebody also with... Um, um, Somebody with, it almost feels like a stroke, uh, a numbness that goes up on one side of the face. Uh, it's definitely the one side. If I had to guess, it would probably be the left side. But, you know, if, if it's yours is on the right side, grab this word for yourself. That's me, Lord. I, I, I will receive that. You know, so, Lord, whatever is causing uh, almost like a toothache stroke, Lord, we just command that up and out right now by the power of the glory of Jesus Christ. We command that up and out right now in the name of Jesus. We command the healing angels on assignment to come and do your bidding right now in the name of Jesus Christ. And Lord, we just say be healed now yes, by the Lord. glory of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You want to do Lisa's? Yeah. Thank you, Lord. We're you taking a break. Thank you, Lord. Just uh, type if you feel God doing something in the comments. If you feel fire, electricity. Sometimes you don't. Just type and share any of your testimonies. And before we get off of here, if there's anything that we haven't prayed for that you need healing, just type it in the comments real quick before we get off here. We want to just pray for you and uh, honor what Holy Spirit's doing right now. We just release the glory yes, over everybody Jesus. under the sound of our voice. Lord, anybody that needs to create a miracle, I thank you in your presence, God. In your presence of full is fullness of joy. And I thank you you're restoring joy in people's life because when you need to create a miracle, that, you know, the enemy comes to steal, kill, and destroy, and, and to suffer through that process. And God cares, and he wants to recreate. And there's no time and distance in the spirit. Yes, there's no limitations. So we thank you, Lord, for creative miracles, even in the atmosphere of glory right now. That everybody under the sound of our voice who needs creative mm-hmm. miracle, we just thank you that Jesus Christ is the healer. And by his stripes, you are healed. And we thank you, Lord, for recreation. Yes, recreation. Recreate. I actually see uh, new kidneys coming into somebody right now. Right mm-hmm. now, in the name of Jesus thank Christ, Jesus. we just thank you for that new kidney, that organ. Right now, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. And so I'm going to go out on line again. I tell you. <laughs> Yeah. I tell you, it, it, it's really awesome, groovy, gravy. Jaw surgery years back, had mental, metal, 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 and will like my mouth to be back to normal. All right, Sarah, thank you for joining. I don't know if we know each other, but uh, or my wife God can do it. <laughs> but God can do it. Um, I, I, I'm going to pray this, and then I, I will also share with you that I've seen plenty. My wife and I uh, actually prayed, and actually she prayed in the small group, and, and somebody had metal in their, their what was it, ankle or something? Foot, yeah. Foot, and I actually got jealous, guys. I get my, <laughs> she can't do this without me, Lord. You know, that's my expertise. I said, God, come that's on now. Goes, iron I said, iron I said what is this? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure we've never said anything about our spouse, right? <laughs> Nah, we're pretty open. <laughs> we're open to sharing each other's stories because uh, how many times have we seen metal turn uh, 30, dissolved? At least 30 plus. So, yeah. But we, we can do that later on. But here's the deal is when I see, you know, someone's got metal in their in their foot, whatever, I mean, I'm like, hey, God, look at this. This is in somebody's tooth board. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, let's go for it. <laughs> I mean, we're already in a canoe He's going down the stream of Holy way. Spirit. Yeah. It's like, what are you going to do? Honey, sorry, I'm going to have to back up because my theology <laughs> just has no room and concept for it. Bell, 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 this is not right. You know, let's get out of this boat. Our, our theological, our doctrine doesn't have room for it. You know what? I'm like, okay, row, row, row your boat. Lord, wherever you're going to go, we're going to go. What are you going to say? We're going to say. And we're going to rely upon the word of the Lord with his promises that are yes and amen. I know you may be looking at me and listening to Signs me. Signs follow those who believe. Signs follow those who believe. And you may be looking at me, listening to me right now, or a little bit later on, and say, man, I like this guy. Man, he's just, he's just on the cuffs. You know, he just goes for it. He's got that tenacity, you know. And so, yes, it's all about him. But... What I saw here is, and we'll pray for you, sir, in just a second, uh, is I had a word of knowledge. Somebody actually has two teeth, uh, and it looks like uh, water into wine, metal into bones. I love that quote. (laughs) 
<laughs> I do love that. I actually quote that scripture verses, you know, when I start praying for people, supernatural stuff. Uh, uh, uh-huh. So you add in the five loaves and two fishes, right, Megan? Meg? And so if somebody has kind of like a bridge or something up front here, it's almost like, like you can actually take it in and out of your mouth. Uh, and it's on the top side, and so you just just slide it into your mouth. Which way is my fingers, honey? This way, <laughs> Oop, right there. I feel like a rabbit, you know. <laughs> Anyhow, you know, you can have a little fun, even with deliverance. You know what God spoke to me? He just makes me a little funny in deliverance. You know, it's just to, the, uh, to break things up because we get too serious. You know, it's just a spirit. But anyhow, let's just keep on going, honey. So, Lord, right now, I just declare and decree as a man of God right now that whoever has this lining... Uh, it almost looks like an insert. And Lord, I do not have that official word. And somebody on here, maybe he's a doctor or whatever, may know what that, like an implant. Uh, but you can take it out. That's the thing. You can take it out at will. And so you can put it in and you can take it out. So Lord, we just declare and decree, Father, right now in the name of Jesus, Lord, that you would just put brand new teeth in. Lord, that they will not have to take it out right now. Lord, you could put two teeth right now in the name of Jesus. Uh, in the name of Jesus, I broke my two top front teeth while I was six, but I can't take them out. So, Lord, right now, they're cemented in. Well, that's a good thing. <laughs> so, Lord, right now, well, you know what he can do? If, if this, I, I hear what you're saying, so it's kind of like half of the story I have, uh, but he can put brand new there. But specifically, I, I learned from Charlie is, you know, we just go with the flow. Okay, all right, we, we, we got this. We, we can pray for you, then, but there's this person. And because right. when you have words like this, is it just it will um, allow God to do what He has and and elevate that faith and when that person we watches this and says you know what this is me Lord I mean I wonder if He's talking about me and just by chance God uh, if that's me uh, you know if He's talking about my two teeth that's missing or you know going in and out Lord I, I receive that right now in the name of Jesus Lord, Lord I just have just say I, Lord I, I just need some of that Lord. I, I will receive that in the name of Jesus. Lord, we just say right now, Lord, just power. Send you create a miracle angel, Father, on assignment right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Give them permanent, permanent teeth right now. Even Meg right now in the name of Jesus. We declare and decree permanent teeth, permanent teeth right now in the name of Jesus Christ. And Lord, um, you know, there are those who may not necessarily have a, uh, a concept of a massage angel. And I, I give names to angel not to base upon what I see and what Holy Spirit gives it to me, but what the function, function is. is. Yeah. And so just understand, please don't take me out of content right here. <laughs> and so if God can do this for other people and take all the pain uh, from the, the vertebrae on the top of their head, the neck vertebrae all the way down to the pelvis bones... I've seen that several times. I'm just going to go for it. So, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus, if there's anybody out there, Father, that he wants to have their teeth bleached right now, Lord, we just release supernatural bleached teeth, bleached uh, teething right now in the name of Jesus Christ. And, Lord, we just release right now bright, shiny teeth, bright, shiny teeth right now in the name of Jesus. We just say teeth be made white right now supernaturally in Jesus' name. Yeah, I'm just looking at some of the comments. So we just command any trauma off from any surgery any jaw surgery trauma right now we just command that off your cellular memory right now right now we just declare right now lord that you can turn metal into bone Lord, we've seen it before so we just ask that you um right now just align with the frequency of heaven we just declare new teeth new teeth new teeth new teeth in the name of jesus christ and lord we just come in agreement right now lord i guess um I just command, um, uh, uh, Sarah, I, I think it's you uh, that I'm seeing right now. It's almost like you have uh, sporadic uh, two surgeries. It could be one tooth and then and like the first tooth here and it jumps and it comes over here and you have a minor teeth here, but these two here are more um, uh, teeth surgery done. And so right now in the name of Jesus Christ, we, we just command the structure of the implants that the doctor has reconstructed and lord i just bind and break off the trauma off of having that father right now in the name of jesus i even break off the the trauma of the accident father and lord we just declare and decree father right now in the name of jesus a blessing to her 
right now from the top of her head to the soles of her feet. Uh, I, I'm also seeing the impact. And so, Lord, we just re- sure. rebuke and command the impact yeah. that has taken to the face area. And we just command it all for her memory, cellular memory right now in the name of Jesus. We just command it right now, off of her memory right now, cellular memory right now, the trauma, we just command it off right now, and we just release brand new jaw bones, we just brand new uh, 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 interior, exterior, a jaw bone lining on the inside, so you have the inside, again, I'm not a doctor, <laughs> but I'm saying what I'm saying, what I'm seeing, oh, I'm not a singer either, so I better stop right there, so the interior and the exterior. So maybe the inside and the outside. So Lord, right now we just call forth it, come forth right now, just like Lazarus who was dead. He was not sleeping, Lord. He was dead to the bone. Lord, you said, Lazarus, come out. And Lord, we say, bones be manifest. Amen. Healing be manifest right now. Everything they need in Jesus' name. Amen, amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. You want to pray over John? Thank you, Lord. So, Lord, we just declare right now for new crowns in the glory right now for Joan in the name of Jesus. We just thank you, Lord, that you, um, <laughs> he's a God that cares. And he's a God that hears our cry. And he's not so far off that he doesn't care about how this tooth is affecting you, Lord. So, we just thank you for crowning people with your glory yes, in the name Jesus. of Jesus. Power, thank fire you. right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. The anointing is right here, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, I just release it right now in the name of Jesus. Lord, we just release the angel of the Lord right now. Every quantum physics, Lord, we just command the elements to form to the substance of what it was prior to the, any trauma that anybody has ever had right yes. now. Lord, we release the lightning bolts. We release the electricity. We release the worthless to tingling, the fire right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Power. Be healed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Every teeth disorder, I command it be healed right now in the name of Jesus. Every teeth condition, we command it be healed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Power. Fire right now in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, I just release that anointing right now upon their their gum lines right now, and their jawbone lines right now in the name of Jesus. Every uh, acute tooth uh, ache. ache right now, we just command it up right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Go be made whole. Supernatural gold crowns, I declare and decree, it manifest now in the name of Jesus Christ. Where there's metal in your tooth, I command it right now to turn the regular bones, flesh right now in the name of Jesus Christ. On the outside of the gum lines, I command command it to be healed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Right now, all pain go. And that sharpness of pain that somebody has uh, uh, every so often, it's right down the middle of your head, right through here. Lord, I command that pain to go right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Mm-hmm. Like April mentioned, if you uh, have a testimony, if you would like to write a comment on here, or if you might be a little shy and say, Richard, you know what? Mm-hmm. Um, I go to a good old Baptist church. I go to a Lutheran church. I go to a church that don't necessarily believe what you're on here doing, but I've received it, and uh, I, I, I'm a little uh, quiet, embarrassed maybe, and uh, if you don't mind, either send me an email or April a, a message on here, or you can message uh, us at Kingdom Flame Ministry, go to our website, or info at kingdomflameministries.com, and, and you have to understand something, there's a reason why I'm saying that, like, for that, it's because sometimes different churches don't have a grid for it. And so, uh, you know, I just say, please just don't be too embarrassed about it, but just send us for that. Um, yeah, so if you don't mind, go ahead and do that. Hey, Esther, uh, can you go ahead and type out what what healing you need in your tooth? I think you mentioned in a, in a message. She's feeling hot in her mouth. Yeah. Um, amen. Amen. So, Lord... Uh, 
uh, she has six or seven, I think, remember. So, Lord, right now, we just, we're going to just go, Joan, I, I, I'm just impressed right now. Lord, Holy Spirit, I thank yeah, you right now. We'll pop back to you in just a minute, Esther. So, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus, we say more Holy Spirit right now. Yeah. Power, fire right now. Right. Fall yeah. in her teeth line, Lord. We say more Holy Spirit, Lord Jesus. More Holy Spirit. Lord, that broken tooth, we just command it to be crowned right now with your glory. Broken tooth, yes. be crowned with your glory. Uh, be crowned. <laughs> be crowned with your glory. Woo! Be crowned with your glory right now in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, we declare and decree, Lord, anyone who has any teeth that is missing. And my wife will tie on here in just a second. Any teeth that has been missing or pulled, extracted, Father, right now in the name of Jesus, whether accidentally or intentionally, Lord Jesus, we just command it to be filled with your glory and your presence. We command new tooth. Tooth come forth. Lazarus come forth in the name of Jesus Christ. Tooth manifest right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Tooth manifest right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Tooth manifest right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, if you can take bones, you can take metal and turn to bone with quantum physics. Lord, this is no difference. Lord, we just declare and decree, Father, that it will manifest Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your presence. Even over her daughter right now, we just declare a, a creative miracle, um, Elsie, for Elsie right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We just thank you, Lord, for touching teeth in your presence right now. Crown them with your glory right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for your presence. I just feel the glory really heavy, so I'm just releasing the presence and the glory over your mouth right now. Right now, just receive, just receive what the Lord is doing right now in the name of Jesus. We thank you for your presence, Lord. We thank you for your glory. We thank you for your presence. In Jesus' name. Numbness. Go for it. So, Lord, we just bind numbness right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We bind all pain and all pain off the sale of memory of the jaw right now by the power of the Holy Spirit. Right now, we speak to that jaw. We say, be made whole right now. Every spirit of infliction, every spirit of infirmity, we command you up and out of that lower jaw right now by the authority of Jesus Christ. So, Lord, right now, um, hey, Joan, is the numbness on one side in your teeth area, is it on the right side or is it on the left side? And I do know there's a, a few seconds delay. Jesus, she put on that other she could say, Could I not have done that? Because she didn't get it. Can I not have done that? Because she didn't get it. Thank you, God. Thank you, Lord, for your presence. Thank you. We honor what you're doing, Jesus. So, Lord, I just thank, thank you, you, Father, right now in the name of Jesus Christ, that the numbness I'm actually feeling on the upper side of my tooth. Uh, it can be different areas, and so if you have any numbness in your in your mouth, your structure, Lord, we just declare and decree, Father, right now in the name of Jesus, right now in the name of Jesus, all numbness come up and out right now, right now, and Lord, I just declare and decree where it has deteriorated, where the nerve endings is not going up in that area, Lord, we just declare and decree that new jawbone muscles come forth right now in the name of Jesus, new jawbone muscles, the structure. The, the tissue, uh, even the del uh, delicate uh, structure on the inside and outside your gum lines, we just command it to come forth right now in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. We're just going to wait a couple seconds and we're going to wrap it up here. Mm, thank you. It Lord. has been a delight to come online. A little bit of scariness to me, but if I'm out a little bit of scariness to me faith and uncomfortable yeah. taking out that risk, yeah, faith, healing is risk, R-I-S-K. And so that's the reason why we came on here and wanted yeah. to bless other people. Send us your testimony so that we can share the spirit of Jesus as the spirit of prophecy. So we thank you for the, the testimonies that people have been sending in to the ministry, so keep sending them. Yes, and my wife is excited for those who have purchased her book mm -hmm. and uh, 
the Chronicles of the Discerner, and uh, the numbers on Amazon is actually going up, and so she is excited about that. And uh, but it excites her because she knows that she's put a lot of effort in it, a lot the of time. The number of testimonies, um, yeah. The number of testimonies who have increased in the gift of discerning mm-hmm. of spirits. Um, yes, please watch rewatch. The replay. Yes, and amen. so we just say, amen. if you want to check us out, go over to kingdomflameministries.com. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can email at us as well as info at kingdomflameministries.com. Uh, we have some uh, awesome resources on our website. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can either take the classes that April's taught with other people and by herself. And one of the one of the awesome ones is the introduction to deliverance. And uh, mm-hmm. and so check it all out. See what we have. We can uh, answer any questions after we're done. Just let us know, and we say bless. So, Lord, right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, we just bless those that are on here who has watched the full setting. And, Lord, we bless those who are going to be watching the replay. And, Lord, we just say more Holy Spirit, more Holy Spirit, more Holy Spirit right now in the name of Jesus. And I do have one other last word of knowledge. Whoever's on here who has a pen, I'm going to use the word pen leg, uh, it's it's on my left hand side and it's on my hip bone area, mm-hmm. almost where the belt line is at, and it's about three inches over and it's in the front side of your leg and it goes down. Mm-hmm. So Lord, we just say right now in the name of Jesus that that pin leg be removed, the structure of it, Father, right yeah. now in the name wow. of Jesus Christ. We just command it to be whole right now in the name of Jesus. Touch that person right yeah, now, right or we just come into agreement, Father. And we just bless everyone on her, and we say, have a wonderful Jesus-filled day. And what would you like to say, honey? Lord, I just ask that you continue to to, uh, open up um, realms of encounter with you, Jesus. Hmm. We just thank you for your presence. We just thank you, Lord, that you just uh, uh, realize that you are the Holy of Holies. You are the place where God's Spirit dwells. You are the New Testament, New Covenant believer. So we thank you, Lord, that even as we get off of here, that you just allow the Holy Spirit to touch you right now and just receive in his glory every creative miracle that's needed. Just receive it in his presence. Just cultivate his presence in your life. In Amen. Jesus' name. So I'm just going to... My wife is getting the mouse ready to end this thing. But, Lord, I'm just going to do a generic prayer right now of divine healings and miracles. Lord, yeah. for whatever they need in their life, yeah. Lord, that we haven't just, we just, oh, Lord, wow. just covered basically the mouth area, the jawbone area, Father, right now. Okay. Lord, I declare and decree, Father, right now, whatever, whatever divine healing they need, Lord, whatever they have, Lord, that they ask of you, Lord, right now in the name of Jesus, that you will cover them from the top of their heads to the folds oh, of their goodness. feet. And, Lord, we just release the fire angel, Father, on assignment right now in the name of Jesus. Right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We just release your goodness and your dunamis power right now. And, Lord, I just declare and decree, Lord, that healing angels on assignment, Lord Jesus, right now. We just declare and decree breathing be healed right. Digestive system be healed right now. Gum lines be healed right now in the name of Jesus Christ. And, Lord, I just declare and decree every body part that they need a healing of, Lord, we thank you, Holy Spirit, that you're visiting them right now and touching you, them. Lord. And, Father, I thank you, Lord, that you told me 80%, Lord, when I have a word of knowledge, Lord, that a manifestation will happen. And so, Lord, we just say, God, that as they re- declare and decree in their mind or even t- take their hands as a point of contact and touch that body part, we just say, let the fire of God come through their fingertips and heal that organ. We declare and decree in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. All right. Amen. Well, be blessed. We will see you later. Bye.